Good morning everyone. It is Friday, October 2nd. Hey, I'm going to shoot this quick video on building remarketing lists on the YouTube campaign. So a couple months back, YouTube came out, not a couple months, sorry, a couple weeks back. They have came back out and merged the normal campaign. So you used to have a separate, you'd have your AdWords campaign and then you'd have your video ad campaign. They've kind of merged those. So I want to show you guys how to build lists. This is for a blog I've been creating. So if you come over here, this is going to be quick. So when you're designing YouTube ads, you have the ability to build retargeting lists. Um, when I say retargeting, so let's say you're over here on a YouTube channel, and I watch this video. So this is a wide draw video. Hello. And bam, I start to watch this video. Well, immediately what happens is Google will cookie you and say, okay, this guy watched this video, and you're able to then take a uh, different one of your videos and run them um, like, just say this one if he watches that video I now want to run him this new video created for Bridgestone or I think this is just the demo video of all of our videos okay so so it's the same as retargeting for your website if somebody goes to your website they get a cookie stuck on their computer you can then run them ads throughout the internet well, with YouTube remarketing, if they watch one of your videos, you are then able to build a list and show them other videos that you create. Got it? So I'm going to show you how to do that. Basically, you're going to be here on your campaign. This is your home. You can see all the different campaigns I've run in. You're going to go down here to shared library. And there's a few ways to get to it, but it's a little confusing. Okay, most of the time you'll see this page right here. Right, you're going to go over here to this tab, Video Remarketing. Hit View. You can see all of these different lists that I have created. So first thing I do, I always tell people to create a marketing list that has that cookies anyone that watches any video on their site. So if you viewed any video as an ad, so if you watched any of my ads on my channel, there's 100,000 of you right here in this list that I can choose to target to. Okay, um, let's look at another one. Okay, similar to viewed wait, wait, wait video. So I have a video called wait, wait, wait video. It's, it's a specific one that I'm running ads to. So, so far, I've had 51,000 people view that video. I then tell Google, I just go up here to Google and say, hey, I want you to create another list. So let's say viewed a video as an ad. So if they viewed that video, or I can say, hey, I want you to create a lookalike audience. Viewed certain video ads, where's the lookalike? Subscribe, viewed, commented, liked, viewed any video as an ad, viewed channel, similar to. So I like to go here to similar. Where is my similar tab? That is a mystery. I think it builds them automatically actually so here's a similar to viewed the city video so if they've viewed the city city video then I have a similar which I can click on this and I can start running them video ads okay similar to this so whenever you create one that um, YouTube automatically is going to create a similar one for you okay similar to explaining video all visitors these are just different lists. So similar to explaining video landing page. Okay. Does that make sense? If you have questions, you can always contact me. But that is where you're going to find your remarketing list. So you just go in here, click on remarketing list. Let's build one that just says viewed any video on my channel, on YDraw channel, put its name. I like to put like a 30-day one. Then I like to do a 540-day one because I really think there's power in the list that you build you're able to go back and market them so you might as well be building these lists whether you're going to use them all the time or not you might as well be building them like here's a really good list there's 680,000 people anyone who's viewed a video on my page basically I'm collecting them as a list and then you have similar viewed a video on my page 10,000 got it so if you have any questions well 33,000 on this one sorry I went down so similar to viewed any video on my page there's 33,000 of them Got it. Okay, now let's go back 
and I'm going to show you how to actually run an ad to these lists. So you're just going to go here to campaign. You're going to go down here to video campaign. You're going to obviously go through all of this, put in where you want to market it to. It, when you're doing a remarketing list, you don't have to worry about some of this stuff. So I don't want it to be in display. I don't like to do Google Partners. I just like it to be in the on the YouTube video side if I'm doing remarketing. Okay. Um, put in a budget, 100. I only want United States. That's where most of people are coming from. Okay. So down here, you go down to remarketing. I'm going to remarket to, to I'm going to go similar to remarketing list. Similar to views, any video on my page. Similar to view that. Similar to view my city. So I'm going to do one to these. And then all you do is say done. And save ad group. And you're going to start marketing to them. Got it? Hope that made sense. If you have questions, email me. Jace, J-A-C-E, at whyinkmarketing.com. And also, hey, on our homepage, whyinkmarketing.com, there is a free consultation. If you guys are not running video ads, you should be. If you're not building a remarketing list, you should be. Let us know. We'd love to set up a free consultation with you to discuss it just to see if we can help in some way. And other than that, I'll talk to you later. I'm out.